Allow me to introduce myself. Who knows what dastardly crime he might perpetrate next? He's a very clever arch criminal who must be put away. Another innocent victim of genocidal mania. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Happy Sunday. Uh, <laughs> my video went live. I want to say like I almost lifted my wrist. I'm so used to wearing a watch, you guys. I'm so discolored from the watch. Anyways, um, it is, I believe, 20 to 1. My video went live about 40 minutes ago. First video that went live after monetization. Now... All my previous videos have been monetized so you guys can go back and make sure to watch the full ad but that's not what i hope on here for <laughs> i hope on here to greet you guys and welcome you to a new vlog um you saw me in the morning i was going to church um i couldn't vlog much uh, church changed locations from edenville to bedford view it's gonna be exciting times ahead man exciting times but um god is good god is good nonetheless this week i am heading down to durban oh, i'm going home actually i'm going to a shower and then i'm picking up a baby and we are going to um durban she's graduating my baby i mean my niece my sister's daughter my sister that just passed away two weeks ago um she didn't wait for her baby's graduation but um i've taken it upon myself to see to it that it happens and to see to it that you know she's got someone from home supporting cheering her on and helping her prepare so we've been planning that she's finally stable <laughs> um it's been an emotional roller coaster i'm not gonna lie not just for me i mean i think for her kids it, it's I, I can't even begin to imagine how they are feeling but i am here um oh my man is here and i'm trying by all means to show up in every way that i can and that includes me driving down to durban um i'm gonna pick her up i'm gonna do her makeup i'm gonna go home on friday morning her graduation is friday in the afternoon so i'm gonna go home friday morning pick her up and then um do her makeup I'm gonna get dressed have a photo shoot I still, I still need to speak to one of the guys and see if they're available um, from Durban, from Ziana Media. And go for a shoot and then I'm going to drop her off at school. She's going to do her thing, do her thing, and then we're going to go back home. So that is the plan. Um, also, Mandisa's dad. Mandisa, if, I mean, you guys, I mean, she was literally on the channel like three weeks ago. I did her bedroom. Actually, it's four weeks now. Jeez, time flies. But four weeks ago, um, I did her bedroom uh, makeover and unfortunately her dad passed on as well. So I'm going to go to the funeral. It is in Durban. I'm going to be in Shoe, but from Shoe to Durban, it's like an hour and a half drive. It's really not a train smash. So I'm going to go to the funeral as well just to show my support for my girl and be there and whatnot. And yeah, and then the weekend is done. That is the plan I have for this week. There's nothing else. Um, really, there's genuinely nothing else. Um, it's going to be a very slow week. I've got assignments that I need to do. Um, you guys can see I've got a broom over there. I've got a bag over here. My mind is just out of sorts. But as I said, when I started this clip, I said, God is still God. And he is. He's still God and he's still moving. And I'm trusting for strength. Because that's the one thing I desperately read right now. I am so exhausted. But um, yeah. Let me get to doing my schoolwork. Assignment due date is Tuesday. I believe I can finish it today. Delusional? Yes. Possible? Maybe. Um, will I push myself? 100%. Will I finish? Yeah, I'll finish. But will I sleep? No, ma'am. <laughs> um, but yeah, yeah, let me get to doing my work and I will speak to you guys when I can. Yeah. <laughs>
today, but I just came to a parcel. I've already scratched out the important details, by the way. That's why I can freely show you guys. So even if you try to zoom in, you're not going to see anything. <laughs> but I just received my parcel from my runway, and this is so freaking exciting. Let me take a scissor. I'm in the office, by the way. I've got my tea and rusks over there. But I thought I should unbox this with you guys and show you what I got. This is in preparation for the weekend. I am going to Durban. Well, I'm going home, actually. My sister's daughter is graduating. Literally, the sister that I just buried like three weeks ago. The baby is getting hooded. <laughs> and i just could not miss it for the world so i'm going down i'm also going to go to mandisa's dad's funeral since i'm already going to be in kzn so i might as well just show my support to my home girl um if i can just get this thing opened wait guys the okay, okay. box is opened and these are the things that i got oh my goodness so i got this plain white polo shirt um, I'm gonna wear it on Saturday. Uh, absolutely, absolutely love it. Oh my goodness. Oh wow, 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 wow. Yeah, I'm excited. I'm interested to see how this is gonna fit. I'm hoping it's more of a um, slim fit. Really? Okay, so I got that. And then I got these uh, wait a minute wait a minute let me open it up So I also got this perfume. This is the Sarah Jessica Parker perfume in the scent, lovely. Uh, literally don't know how this is gonna smell like, but I'm gonna check now. And then I got guest glasses. I hope you guys can hear me. I'm in the office, so I can't necessarily shop. But This is empty because the glasses are here, but I'm going to show you guys just now. But this looks absolutely stunning, classy. The case, uh, amazing. Okay, and then oh, these are the glasses, and they look just like so. They've got this. Let me try and focus you guys so you guys can see. Okay, you see? They've got this guess in uh, writing over here. And then also on the lens, I know that that's what I like about them. Very discreet, but it's got the guess over here. And absolutely stunning, guys. These are perfect, 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 perfect. How cute is that? Okay, this is so pretty. And they also came with the pamphlet and whatnot, but I think I'm just gonna go ahead and put them inside so that they don't scratch because these are not cheap, I'm not gonna lie. They were not cheap at all. And they've got this cloth and it's written guests as well on them. So that's very pretty. That's very pretty. I'm tempted to open okay, not even I'm tempted. I am gonna open this. 
because I do want to smell it, see whether or not I like it. It might just potentially be an everyday perfume, I don't know. But, ooh, it's so cute. Uh, okay, so this is the bottle. My goodness, you guys, it is so dainty and so pretty. But this is what it looks like. I love this over here. It's got a cloth, it's a silky ribbed cloth over here. And it's just nice and cute. Hmm. Interesting. Oh my gosh, it smells so amazing. It smells so, so, so amazing. Jesus. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Anyways. That is all that I got from my runway this time around. I've bought some things. They have bought a um, watch. I've bought... What else have I bought from my runway? Mm, I don't know what else I've bought, but this is not my first order. And as per usual, I'm very, very, very happy. I'm excited to try on this shirt and see how it fits. But I love it. I really do love it. It's just a nice, simple white shirt really button down shirt with the polo um stitching or rather the logo on it very discreet very nice so this is exciting um but yeah let me get to work and i'll talk to you guys when i talk to you <laughs> the shirt the shirt the shirt ma'am okay this is i said you guys saw it fits quite literally perfectly it is the perfect size everything everything is perfect and it's just so soft and beautiful size 32 i mean yeah i mean i can go ahead and take off the you guys are not going to see it but I can go ahead and take off the tag i'm very very happy with this very happy yeah i don't need to fight i don't need to complain nothing zero milk not a <laughs> To your eyes, I see we're out of time I guess no one's to blame, nobody crossed the line I guess we couldn't see, somehow we couldn't feel Maybe we rose so fast, maybe we got too high afternoon good freaking afternoon it's thursday evening you guys okay well it's afternoon actually it's thursday though i am uh i'm where am i i'm at the i'm on the battlefield um route he just entered a machuba heading towards newcastle i'm going home my baby is graduating you guys my baby is freaking graduating Oh. <gasps> Guys, this freaking van almost hit me. Can you believe it? Oh my god. I am so. What the freak? Ah uh ah. -uh. Hey, Okay, 
Okay guys, let's try that again. This van almost hit me because he was trying to bypass me and a truck on a curve and there was another car coming or rather oncoming. So he literally just almost slammed me and pushed me out of the way. And he didn't even apologize. He sped right through. Guys, people are possessed on the road. I'll tell you that people are possessed by the devil. They just feel like they want to spill blood. And I come against every spirit. I come against every demonic activity that might, might want to show itself on this road trip. Absolutely not. I will not play that game. I will not do that. They will not today. Anyways, I'm going home. I'm pretty sure I already told you guys, but my sister's daughter is getting married. No, she's not getting married. She's graduating. Oh my gosh, I'm still thinking about Gia. <laughs> but she's graduating. So I'm going to be there for my baby. You know, I'm her aunt. She's my niece, my baby girl. And I will do anything for family. You guys know, I go above and beyond for my friends. For family, uh, I will shut the whole world down. That's what I'll do. So I'm going home. Um, and then Saturday, I'm also going to hop back to Durban because she's graduating in Durban. So we're going to drive from Mishawa to Durban on, on tomorrow, actually. And then Saturday, we are, I'm going to go back. I am going to go back to Durban because my dear friend is burying her dad. It's been a hectic week. I'm not going to lie. But by the grace of God, we are all still standing and i couldn't have it any other way so yeah i will talk to you guys as we go hopefully maybe i don't know um but Everything about you is understand What Yes, girl. <laughs> yes, girl. 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 Yes, Show me the dark days. Take me on. Share your
good morning welcome back it's a new day it's tuesday i'm back from my little road trip i'm so exhausted yesterday i couldn't even think when i got here on sunday i couldn't even speak i went straight to bed i came i woke up I made food, I got on with my accounting assignments, which was due yesterday. By the grace of God, I was able to start and finish it. You guys, I hadn't even started it. That's how distracted I had been, but I finished. Luckily, I'd done the calculations prior to that, on roughly on a paper. So I just had to transfer all of that information onto a, um, onto a solid document. But yeah, I made the submission. I don't know how my mask is going to look like, but I've been doing quite well um, so far. I now have one last assignment outstanding for the semester. Um, and then I'm preparing for my exams. I am so exhausted. I'm so exhausted. Guys, this postgraduate diploma is going to knock me out. But it's necessary because the modules that I'm doing now are going to be credited towards my MBA next year. So there's that but yeah i just finished getting ready uh hey is late i did a little side or rather middle part niana situation I'm showing my edges i'm gonna go to work i'm very late it is 20 past eight I'm supposed to have left the house like over 15 minutes ago but i've just been dragging really i'm just exhausted i'm over being in the office i'm over the year i'm over my job i'm over everything <laughs> but it is what it is so let's get to work shall we good morning good morning good morning hello hi it's a new day it is wednesday i'm feeling so much better today i'm feeling rested um heading to work coming back from work i need to go remove my nails i broke a nail yesterday i hit myself with the door guys i slammed a door on my finger and this nail broke i was still loving the nails still loving the color but I gotta take care of this so after work i'm gonna go get these nails removed but that's absolutely fine um i think i just want to do gel overlay without the tips this time around and grow my natural nails i i had got a sneak peek of my nail underneath it's looking so healthy and it's feeling so um you know health hard rather and i am just excited to see what my nails can become i haven't had healthy nails in a very very long time um but yeah let's get to work and i'll speak to you guys later bye 